Hello, good friends, it's the Twy Keen, and thanks for joining me for the next episode of the Age of Calamity Efficiency Challenge. So, before we get into the first mission of Chapter 6, it's time to get quite a few side challenges done, and I'm pretty sure they're going to take at least two or three episodes to get through. <laughs> we'll start with uh, one up here, but it's going to involve uh, some dojoing first, so let's go to the military training camp and get uh, Yonobo upgraded to level 50 and then uh, Daruk up to 50 as well so that didn't cost too many rupees roughly 3,000 and they have a mission somewhere in here uh, nope not anti-flame training this one right here apprentice Yunobo gotta take on like a Lionel, a Hinox, and even a stone talus <laughs> playing as Yonobo and Daruk. <laughs> so, let's see how well we do with this. This place is crawling with monsters. Great. Good time to let loose, eh, Yonobo? Absolutely. Especially with a blue Hinox in the way. <laughs> Already got a hit on its eye. Hard to believe. Defeat the white-maned Lionel and key enemies. <laughs> well, that includes this blue Hinox as well. It lifts up trees, of course. Eh, couldn't back away from him. Eh. Making me dodge a lot of his uh, tree attacks with ease. Eh. Oh, here he goes, rolling. Alrighty, not bad. Alrighty, now he's more than halfway down. Let's go ahead and give him this. Well, we got Daruk helping me out a bit. That's fine. Come on, let's see you do your somersault on me. He's almost down. Down he goes. We did it. I actually helped. <laughs> oh. Stupid Korok. No, no. <laughs> Stupid Bacoblin. <laughs> Trying to ruin the party here. Alrighty. Time to head on up. Take on the other enemies. Things certainly are heating up. Yeah, watch out for the... Say, is Daruk even following me? It doesn't look like he is. Now, let's... Direct him to the stone talus. Have Yonobo take care of these with Zophos along the way. <laughs> it's just too bad a lot of these take quite a while to beat up. <laughs> Oh, 
Watch out for them. this way. Here comes the stone talus. Good thing the uh, Lionel is just in another area. Hmm. Gosh, he's already showing no mercy here. Rook is getting close to me. Take this. Yeah, let's get a ride on him. He's still down. <laughs> Hard to believe. <laughs> Did I just break off one of his arms? Oh, now he got it back. <laughs> Watch out for that. Want to save special attack gauge for the Lionel. Nope. Get out of the way. Oh. Alrighty, got him with that. You know, though, you shouldn't apologize for this. <laughs> we did it. Too quick. That was invigorating. Oh. I was wondering where the Lionel was. I thought he would be in that uh, room, but he's not. Just go ahead and give him this. You're not going to like this. Ah! Oops. All righty. Man, he looks like he will take uh, just a little while to beat up. Ooh. Ooh! I'll tell you what, the Cryonis that Yonobo unleashes was hitbox friendly. Half of the time limit remains. Yeah. We'll be fine. Perfect hit on him. Ugh. That really surprised me. Yeah, I would say Yonobo probably has the best Cryonis of the bunch. Alrighty, let's give Yonobo a breather and I think Daruk has, like, the best bomb. Watch out. Man, oh man. Ooh, got that flurry. Now he's down. Or not. Because <laughs> he needs just a few more hits. Oop. Nah, didn't get a chance to activate the Cryonis there, but whatever. That Lionel is history.
Got a hundred bacoblins beat up. <laughs> Alrighty, that one is down. Let's go ahead and take on another one that involves uh, another ex a character I can't use uh, Link for. Down here, Teba's training. Gotta play as Teba. He's already at level 40, but let's just go ahead and use him as level 40. All he has is just a Moblin and Pacoblins. So, let's uh, do this. Okay, gotta defeat 300 enemies in <laughs> 5 minutes. And the way Teba moves around, gosh, it's almost as wonky as uh, Riju moves. It really is. I mean, uh, you would think that his movement pattern when tapping Y repeatedly would uh, be as simple, but it's really not. It kind of throws you off a bit. But at least we got a, a good start of enemies down. Okay. Wait for a larger cluster of enemies to show up before I uh, use the special attack. I think I got an idea. Yeah, just bring this down. <laughs> to bring down all the enemies. <laughs> that would help. Okay, there's still not a large cluster of enemies uh, surrounding me. Say, so until I can get a lot of them to just uh, gather around me like this, I'll use it. But I don't want to take up too much time, though. This should be good enough. Alrighty, that looked like a good 30 enemies or so beaten up. Yeah, here come many more Bacoblins. <laughs> Gosh, stop launching your rocks at me. Alrighty, got to 200. Okay. Alrighty, this much should help. That's a lot better. Oh, they just appear behind me. <laughs> 291, 293. Almost there. So I'm still expecting a Moblin to show up after I get to 300. Okay. Now I can take care of the Black Moblin. Oop. Eh, doesn't look like I activated the Cryonis quick enough. Come on. Man, I can't get his weak point gauge down quickly enough. Let's bask in this triumph. Alrighty, that didn't take too long. Only took like four minutes or so. Took down 320 Bacoblins. Looks like another side challenge related to Teba has appeared. Okay, there's Rejuice training, which I'll probably get to next, but I want to see what this is really fast. Winged Escort for um, Teba. 
Uh, let's hop into uh, Rejuice training, which has uh, quite a lot of enemies here. Moblin, and, but mostly uh, Lizophos. Variety of Lizophos. <laughs> I guess uh, let's go ahead and take on her challenges. Alrighty. Here we go, taking on a lot of these Zophos in the rain. Defeat many enemies before time runs out. Yeah. Trying to grab that crate. I guess it already broke. <laughs> Gotta defeat 300 enemies in <laughs> five minutes, by the way. Probably just to spawn a uh, moblin at the end. And the moblin and the allies have already appeared. Are already. Already up to 88. I uh, couldn't quite pull off the uh, flurry. There we go. Fire breathing Lizophos have appeared. Ugh. Not like this. Hmm. Didn't quite deplete his whole. Weak point. There we go. All right, down goes the moblin. Trying to get some more Lizophos down. Only up to 158. That really didn't help as much. One eighty two now. Electric Lizophos have appeared. Okay. Oh, th with this many surrounding me, they should all go down. Okay, up to two forty seven. Alrighty, that's really helping speed things up. Okay, up to Yeah, they take quite a while to beat up. Eight more to go. Now six. Now only four. <laughs> okay, you gotta defeat the black moblin. Which is way over there. Alrighty, got him down to about half health. We're slowly but surely getting him down. Glad that's done.
Like I said, Riju's movement it really throws you off, just like Teva's. Glad that's done. Like I said, Riju's movement it really throws you off, just like Teva's. Glad that's done. Like I said, Riju's movement it really throws you off, just like Teva's. And this, uh, this particular challenge has a Korok seed tied to it, so gotta find that as well. Yeah. Okay. You'll be escorting me to Rito Village. That's a, much obliged. <laughs> yeah, let's just go ahead and take some of these down, but to get the uh, Korok, I have to head to a tree stump in the north just above the northern outpost. Tough to bring down. Too bad I don't have a full attack gauge. Just stop. I'm like, why can't I activate this? <laughs> I mean, I'm pressing X, I just had to like let go of a, another button, I guess. That looks a lot better. Alright. Down goes that. Uh, yeah. Let's get rid of the other Black Moblin first. That's better. Now we can take on this Frost Talus. Let's go ahead and burn it. Alright, we got him down to just a little over half health left. Maybe another hit. Add to the trick. Hmm. Don't think it's worth riding because it's going to freeze itself again. Surprised none of those uh, uplifting rocks got to me there. And he's still not done yet. <laughs> Now he's down for good. Okay. Okay, just have to keep going up towards the very top. Get rid of the stone pebble too. Got a nice with robe up here. Let's take care of him. Huh. 
I mean, bombs with uh, Teba is pretty good, too. Guess we should just go across this bridge. Nope. Of course I... The Zophos would freeze me like that. And they're really hurting me a lot. Yeah, with two of them at once. Not that easy to fend off. Really fun to stop both of them at once. <laughs> now that I'm giving them both a weak point smash, they should all go down at once. Perfect. Okay, before we give him to the uh, targeted position, let's take care of that uh, Korok. It should be up here. I think I see the stump. There it is. Uh, like, don't do this to me, game. It's right there. Captain gonna make it in here? Apparently, uh, Octoroks are distracting him. He should be good now. Yeah, he's already heading in. An Ice Lionel. Oh gosh. Not gonna be easy to defeat an Ice Lionel with Teba. Oh. I don't think that even reached him. Well, can't use Cryonis now. If I had a big waste of a bomb right there. Oh boy. That's better. Now he's about halfway done. Looked like he was stuck there for a minute. Yeah, I really had to heal myself a bit there. Can't take too many chances with a Lionel. Spinning ice blocks, I guess, was a big help. Eh. Oh boy. Watch out. Okay. 
man. Being utterly relentless, not giving me much of a chance to deplete its weak point gauge. It really isn't. I got a flurry for that, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, got him with that. Is this going to be enough to finish him off? Of course not. Still gonna be a little while. up a bit. A couple more hits. Down. Ooh. Gosh, this took longer than I really wanted it to be, but at least I didn't really have to save it for the next video or anything. Okay, another kind of challenge appeared after clearing Tebas, but it involves just Link himself, the so-called knight. <laughs> of course, that'll be saved for another video. I don't think it'll be in the next one anyway, because we still got some other challenges exclusive to ones other than Link. <laughs> so, we'll have to save it for that. Anyways, that'll do it for this edition of the Age of Calamity Efficiency Challenge. I hope you guys enjoyed, thanks for watching, and I'll see you good friends in the next video. Have a great day. So long.